Hello, I'm Amber Dakar. A new report reveals massive shortfalls in state and municipal pension funds. The report from professors at Northwestern University and the University of Rochester found a total unfunded liability of $574 billion in some of the nation's largest plans. That's in addition to nearly $3 trillion in unfunded pension promises made by the states. These shortfalls threaten the viability of municipal services like law enforcement, public parks, and libraries. The report examined pension funds in 50 major cities and counties. It found that many of them set impractical investment earning goals and understated their liabilities. Now because of the Great Recession, these shortfalls are clear for all to see. To make up for the difference, each household in each of the 50 municipalities studied would have to pay more than $14,000 to current and past government employees. Clearly, the changes will have to be made to the existing state and municipal plans to solve the problem. Possible solutions include moving new hires to a defined contribution plan such as a 401k or raising the retirement age for government employees. The Great Recession, the continuing housing foreclosure crises, and a real unemployment rate of 17.1% are taking their toll on governments from the city to the federal level. Adding a potential pension shortfall crisis to the mix has just made a bad situation even worse. Thank you for watching.